I love me some Tom Cruise. I love him. I've worked for Tom Cruise. I've doubled for him. I've stood in for him. He's a fucking fantastic human being as a one-on-one interpretation. But apparently, other people don't think the same thing. And that leads me to my next conversation because apparently, Leia Ramini says that, well, Tom Cruise is not the best person to Scientology people because Scientology is going through some shit and she's suing them right now. So I want to talk about Leia Ramini. Okay, so Leah, that's poor Leah woman. Remini. Leah, Leah Remini. Leah Remini. Leah. I want to talk about Leah Remini. Leah Remini. Leah Remini. Leah Remini. 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 Brian Remini. Remini. I want to talk about Leah Remini. 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 Everybody. I want to talk about Leah Remini. Remini. So Leah Remini. There is coming go. forward and she Leah. has been suing the church of scientology and we don't really talk about politics this almost seems like politics in a way but we're going to talk about it because it's entertainment news but leah remini came forward and said i'm suing them because of something that went down mm, back when tom cruise and katie holmes were married so apparently after that whole fact she was talking to people at the actual wedding and she was talking about a ghost bringing up the man himself you know of scientology Supreme, what's his name miskovich, miskovich. david miskovich you, did. David miskovich. you mentioned and she was saying, where's brian where where's his fucking wife where but where's where but where, where, lexi where's his fucking wife she's fucking been gone for years so anyways <laughs> so i yeah. mean yeah. miss kavis's yeah. wife has been ass. missing for years she that is absolutely true like, we all I miss those Katie ads Holmes. on my phone every fucking day when I'm on YouTube being like, David believe us when we tell you what's happening. I get it. When I moved to Los Angeles, I'm like, yeah, I'll never forget this. I moved to Los Angeles. I was on central casting. And it's a place where you're going to sign up, be an extra for acting. Oh, fucking be an extra. Be awesome. And you go down there and I signed up and I walked outside and there was this whole recruitment camp right there. Right. Oh, no. And they're like, hey, hey, are you, uh, are you an actor? And I said, yeah, I'm an actor. I fucking love acting. And they said, oh, so what's your religion? Weird fucking question to ask an actor. But I'm like, mm. at that time, I grew up Roman Catholic. I was, I'm a Catholic. And the guy goes, I am too. But do you believe in the Church of Scientology? And I looked at him, I'm like, again, Catholic, Church of Scientology, big difference. And he goes, I'm a Catholic. I'm also a Scientologist. Listen to me. And I was like, okay, I'm fucking out. You know what I mean? Because it's contradictory. But Brian, what's right. your fate and levels, Brian? Brian? That was the biggest mistake of your career. <laughs> uh, well, what's your I fate and levels, to him. boy? I didn't, I, didn't, I, didn't, I didn't listen to him, Jacob. But that's what I'm saying. The, the Church that's of Scientology, was. You didn't listen a lot of people are involved with it, though. A lot of people are involved with it, though. Tom Cruise, again. Fucking fantastic! Again, I met him. I worked with him. Fantastic human being. Come put your hands on my little this. device over here, Brian. But wow. Lexi, that's a lot. It's that's gonna lot. tell you about these fate and levels, and then you're gonna know some things. It's a lot. <laughs> but Don't you want to know your fate and levels, Brian? I, I, I. They asked me that. They asked me that to come there. They asked me I said, you should come to Scientology and learn your thing levels. And I told them, I told them, I'm good. I'm good. I, that's why I usually say I'm good. I, I just and then I walked away. And they asked me that when I was at the beach. How come you got to ask that of an audition? That's well, Jacob, up. they actually got my phone number beforehand. I was at fucking, it was like 15 years ago. I gave it to them. So they called me and they texted me and all that shit afterwards. Oh, but, they, they saw my dad bod and they were like, yo, you want to do some Scientology? And they said, and like, why not? They're like, Jacob, you got a lot of faith right? in you. Listen, like I will do test. anything. I but, will do anything for a free t shirt. But Jacob, I want to break this down for a second. So <laughs> she went there. She's she's she been involved. She's been involved for a long time, right? Yeah, it's really and she went 35 years. And she went there and she Tom Cruise's wedding, but apparently she said some things and they didn't like it. She was asking where the wife was at. She was asking, like, you know. She does ask where the wife was at. She wasn't doing anything else weird. She just asked report, where Shelly was. A knowledge she report? She was just being a normal person. Yeah, where's Shelly? She where's put your wife, Brian? She put Brian Miscavige? Where is After she? After the knowledge report, though, Lexi. After the knowledge report, they said other people put knowledge reports against her. She's and then they in the sent her hole. Because she was involved, Lexi, <laughs> in the church, they sent her to Florida. And they said in Florida, they sent her to this, this whole Florida, region, which is like the, the, headquarters, go. the headquarters. The headquarters at Clearwater, Florida, the flag, oh, they call the flag, yeah. and they call it. They sent her there. And she said, Lexi, it was one of the worst 
nightmares of her life. Yeah. She went there. Listen, they, when they, you're they, they were that's her, where their they concentration camps her, are. And they told her how yeah. to react to everything. And yeah. she agreed with them. But after the fact, she was like, hey, this isn't right. Like, I, this is not, this is not how I feel. This is not how I think. I was brainwashed. And, and it all came down to Tom Cruise. And they're saying that he's like number two man there. And yeah, that they are brainwashed them. But it's also bringing back to fucking scary. Uh, I mean, when your it's headquarters are in Florida. You're already fucked. It's not a religion. It's ridiculous. Well, it's a religion. Scientology is a cult. It's about Zenu and it's not a religion. Down it's a cult. South. If you want to have a good yes. good interpretation, watch the South Park episode. But you know, you know, they they bring it all up. Right, it's a great. It's a. It's, it's actually it's very accurate. But it's all anime. It's kind of fun. But it's, Tom uh, Cruise it's the loss of chef. That's the episode. That's, that's well, so they good. did. They lost. They lost him to Scientology, and they were really mad about it because he had worked on their show for years. And then he comes in and he's like, I don't think we should be doing the stuff we're doing on their show. And he's just like, uh, they're like, what? what the fuck? Like we've been working with you for how long? And you've been a big supporter of all of us. And then all of a sudden you're like having problems with everything we've been doing. And he's like, yeah, uh, I don't know about this. And they're like, it's because you've been fucking with the Scientologists. And he's like, no, 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 no. And he's like, no, no, yeah, that's exactly what it is. And they're like, no, no, that's what, that's not what it is. And they're like, yeah, yeah. It's because you've been fucking with Scientology. And they're like, we're pissed about this. And he's like, it's a lot. Yeah, I'm not going to work with you guys anymore. And then they're like, fuck you. Like, this is bullshit. Like, that's why. I mean, so that's it, why they wrote it, his character it, off the way they did. But do you think, but, that, that you think that's an issue? Tom Cruise hasn't seen his own fucking kid since Katie Oh, it's Holmes ridiculous. Fucking the Katie Holmes like, stuff and that stuff. Like, that's ridiculous. Like, like, like they take people you know, away from their families. They take people away well, from, you're, like. You're a, you're a, per, you're a, what but, do you call it? Um, uh, a, not a suspicious person. A, um, oh, the shortening is SP. Like, against it's a, church. It's a, but here's my biggest thing. I was going to bring this up. The fact that as she said that she was a captive for four months at this retreat in Florida, and she said she couldn't leave, and they brainwashed her, and that's why there's, she's suing them on top of everything else. But that's a lot. So the question I put out to the group today is like, what the fuck? Like, I mean, like, <laughs> it's a very specific question. I mean, what the fuck? I mean, Leah, like, can you imagine? Like, Leah ramey has been I, I fighting against Scientology for years now. She's oh, put out several specials. Easily she's a put decade, out several, yeah. yeah. I mean, she's been one of the largest proponents against it. She's been trying to get people to listen for a very long time. Um, I feel very bad for her and what she's been through, and I think that she deserves the voice that she has. Scientology is very bad, and they actually get a tax credit from the government, and I think it's disgusting that the government gives they them a tax no credit. Taxes. They are they, they, no, they, they are a tax cult. Credit. They pay no tax credit. They're, they're tax credit. Yeah, Katie Holmes was like, I don't want to do this anymore. Katie Holmes was like, right. I want to leave. Like, then yeah, that that's why she can't talk. That's why he doesn't talk. To, he's like, I don't want to talk to my kid or you anymore. And it's like, oh okay, like. I'm, it's not that he doesn't want to. He sends him presents and shit, but he's not allowed to. Present day. Quote unquote religion. Which is fine. But he, he's so committed to that cult that he doesn't give a shit. Like, yeah. he's like, I don't care. I I'm like, I would rather but, be committed to my I cult mean, than my fucking kids. They're like, oh, it's fucking, oh, oh, Justin, great call. You said you mentioned family so much. It's definitely fast. Yeah, it's, 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 it's definitely oh fast and furious. Oh, yeah, because it's all about family. It's all about family. Truth, but I'm bringing up this. Okay. So, oh. Scientology, it's it, it just, it just like, it makes me be like, if you're, if you're a religion, right? It's why Elrond would Hubbard. you try to, why would you listen like, to L. Ron Hubbard? People into a situation like this, you know, like they really are. Sean, let's go to Sean. Cause Sean's been quiet for a second. Yeah, Sean, the voice first of, of all, Lee, so. Sean's like, no, no, first of all, he never went to me, but please go to Sean. No, I'm going to you next. Sean, go to drink. Go to Go to Sabrina. No, go to you. I'm going to go get a drink. My what am I supposed to say? Sean, take a drink. Sean's like, I'm take thinking about joining Scientology, and I don't want to talk about Sean's this right now. About never <gasps> he's like, yeah, he's like, if I don't join energy. Scientology, my career is done. He's like, I know that in Hollywood, if I want to succeed, I have to join this cult. I'm not and even like, trying. I'm, I'm not even so, like, trying to get a career in Hollywood. Like, I'm just he also fall knows, into it like everything else. And he's like, also, if I talk about this here, there's like a van outside of my house right now that has like a thing on it. He's like, there's aliens painted on the side of it. He's like. They're totally gonna take me away. But Sean, like, I'm scared. I'm what do you scared. think about this? Do you think that <laughs> you think she's lying, or do you think that you know that she's you know telling the truth and this needs to be exposed? Of course, it needs to be exposed. I mean, it's it's the worst kept secret in all of I don't know Hollywood religion, whatever you want to call it. Like 
We know Scientology is bad. We know they have work camps. We know that they bleed their members dry of money and tear apart families. They're almost as bad as the Mormons. Like, it's just a terrible, terrible They're worse cult. than the Mormons, for sure. They're probably worse than the Mormons, but, you know, they, they control... Hollywood, you know, a near, you know, a near industry versus an entire state's ecosystem. Um, you know, like it's just, yeah, I, I, I'm, I am, uh, I am more inclined to believe uh, Leah Remini, I think I got that one right, uh, than I am to, 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 uh, uh, you know, agree, look at all these sexy pictures, else. man. You got all these like sexy pictures of her. Like I swear to she's God, she's the she's the queen of the king of queens. You know what I mean? Yeah, right. That's true. She to was the fair, best. Part she is of that a show. very gorgeous woman. Still, yeah, she, she is, is aged gracefully and looks amazing. And I hope you gotta she give credit where credit's due on TV and film. Yeah. Sean, what's your fate and levels? Come on, come on. No, I feel van. like I mean, I mean, <laughs> definitely, like her career has definitely suffered because of the strong stance that she takes against Scientology. Uh, because her. they're they're powerful and they throw lawyers at you until you bleed to die, bleed to death. So did you read yeah. Elrond's books over here? They're about Can't aliens. Say you I like Can't you say... liked Loki? You like oh, Elrond's Jesus. books? Elrond like likes aliens movie too. About, about the aliens, that's your yeah. You, did you fun. like you liked that movie? Did you? Uh, that, well, that's a. I'm so uncomfortable. This is come fantastic. on over to my fainting <laughs> levels. <laughs> I, I, Jacob, zero expectation. Down I left and right, square root that shit. Bring it up. Real <laughs> I life. already checked my fate and levels and got it. Battlefield down. Earth. I got a copy of it right here in my van. What she said. My fate and machine. What? That that movie. I saw that in the just theater. Do, oh my god! I saw that in the theater too. Who didn't want to see that? And you're like, wow, this is terrible. I love Before that movie. The... <laughs> it's so. I bad. really, I really like that movie. But I had no idea what it was. I just really. It's liked terrible. It. <laughs> They anyways. learned how to fly Harrier jets on simulators, <laughs> and they were anyways. Cavemen. They were cape. Sean, yeah. I agree. Okay, um, Sabrina, do you feel the same way as Sean? <laughs> how do you feel about this? So I, I feel like I, I feel like it doesn't really fucking matter at this point. Um, but yeah, she went to the fucking wedding, asked about the wife. They fucking got pissed. She followed what's called a knowledge report. Um, and then uh, after that, they sent her to this Florida fucking institute for four months and basically psychologically tortured her. She oh. then agreed that it was all her fault. They, but when she got there, they basically gave her a bunch of complaints from everyone at the wedding saying that she was the problem. They tried to just convince her that it was her, not them. And eventually she agreed just to get the fuck out of there. That's victim blaming. Came You're not the king of queens. You're then not. she spent six not at all. months in another facility in... in <laughs> Riverside, I like the golden area of fucking studios or whatever, which by the way has had um, because she had she had the audacity to like Google search um a complaint that was filed there by like some kid who grew up in the Scientology system. Um and so she Googled it and then they, they sent her there for six months and after that then she quit. Um which you know I think is a a, a a very brave and difficult thing to do. The the takeaway for this from me is that they have terrorized her for years. Um, and they have had people watching her and doing things. I read a million articles today of people who like reported on the subject and were followed and and fucking cased. Um, some guy was uh, doing a uh, he was a lawyer, and they had a suit against some sort of a psychiatric drug that the Church of Scientology had a problem with, and he was followed on a regular basis. Um, and he was a lawyer. He was a low level lawyer. He wasn't even the fucking head lawyer of the fucking suit. The whole thing is super fucked. Um, and what they do to people is super fucked, and she is not the only person who's left and had hey. problems. She's the most vocal about it, and I applaud her. It's for good. And uh, they actually made a statement that she should probably move to Russia if she doesn't like free speech. Um, because they've set up smear campaigns about her all over the internet, and anyone else will love you. They're psychopaths, and they fucking like stalk you and then try to get you to join and spend hundreds of thousands of dollars on their classes so that you could be good at nothing. Basically, but they're the whole thing is that they want you to not be able to emote. So, like, there's one girl went in there and took like whatever a test, and then they fucking she was like, "Okay, I'm gonna go," and they're like, "No, you need to take the next class." And they basically berated her, like on the they have like a lie detector situation, but like, um, which is super fucking weird. Um, but basically, like they 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 try to like, throw things at you, and you're supposed to like not react to it. And like then you pass when you're no longer reacting to the bullshit that they're throwing at. You, How is which this? Is, so fucked up and fucking stupid. I don't know why anyone like and this woman was like, I don't want that. Like there was 
the article I read, there was like a thousand comments in, within five minutes. Yeah. And everyone was like, I had, like I, had How- I had an experience. I had an experience. I had an experience. And they're all the same shit. It's all fucked up. you from leaving. Fucking trying. It just, it is, it is. I don't even know. How it's a thing still. I really don't know. How and how is as this? As far as Shelly Mitkovich goes, um, her fucking uh, the she filed a, a missing persons report. Where's the wife? Lawyers, we'll never find the so wife. She's fine. Never. I'm sure they paid lawyers to say she was fine, and like the cops were like, "Okay, that's cool because you're super rich because they don't pay taxes on all the fucking shit tons of money that they extort from poor people who leave their entire family and lives and like let their poor children grow up." And fucking the one guy with the lawsuit basically was like, they threw me in a room with like a bunch of other Scientology because they gave me L. Ron Hubbard books. Like he never had a proper right, education. Right. How- he was homeschooled by L. Ron fucking Hubbard, who, by the way, is a fucking <laughs> loser who fucking sailed around for a fucking few minutes on the fucking ocean with swipe. Um, um, and um, and he's all fucking uh, what's his name? He's an attack. Jeff Proposed and Laboratory guy. What's his name? Jim Parsons. JPO. So yeah. Wife, uh, fucking, which was actually his ex-wife's sister which was super cool of him. yeah um but to be fair it was like an orgy type church situation anyway yeah, yeah, yeah. Alistair Crawley, you guys should google what there's a cbs uh, uh i know exactly what you're talking CBS about streaming thing what is the show it's strange angel you yeah. should watch that um it's very enlightening or use them like google searching on the church of scientology and how it began and you will be fucking shocked at what you read and how this person has somehow like with black magic blood sex orgies has become like someone that fucking Tom Cruise left his own fucking daughter for. Like it's insane. The-